Hello everyone, Nicole K here. Uh, welcome back to Let's Play Supernatural. I just wanted to say that I've created an email address so you guys can contact me. That'll be like the fastest way to contact me. Uh, I'll try to check it as much as I can. I'll have the email sent to my phone, but sometimes my phone thing doesn't go off so I don't always hear it. So if you would like to send me an email, feel free. What the heck was that? <laughs> Did anybody hear that like growling noise? I think I will be putting it above my Instagram username in the description of all the videos from now on. It's also on my channel. I've also set it in, uh, I mean, on Twitter and thesims3.com. And I think, let's see, uh, what was I going to say? I forgot. Oh, it's, it's Nicole K YouTube at live.com. It's just all lowercase. It's all easy to, to spell and remember, unlike my freaking YouTube username. So, Gabby <laughs> is up and about. Oh, no, she's not really up. She's she's tired. Maybe we can... No, we can't really harvest anything. Okay, I'm going to fast forward until they wake up. Then <laughs> I'll be right back. I just wanted to let you guys know that I got a new uh, wand for Gabby. It's called the Iridescent one. It's the most expensive one, and it has high spell accuracy and high magic cost efficiency, which means your your magic doesn't go, it doesn't drain too quickly. Where the heck are you even? I don't even know where she's going. I don't know where she's at. That was really weird. I didn't even tell her to go anywhere. <laughs> so she's going to go back home, and I'll have her work on her spell. I also wanted to show you guys that I downloaded that Hidden Skills Unhidden mod that Andrea Cage showed in his video, which is amazing. I will put a link to it in the description along with a how to install custom content video that I made a while back, just in case you don't know how to install package files. Um, I also show you how to install other types of files, but for the witches, there's a spell casting skill, and there's also this collecting one. I don't know, because it has this this icon already. I don't know if this was already hidden or not. Let me know. Let me know. And there's also a broom writing one. For fairies, you have a fairy magic skill, which Lana is actually learning right now. It's kind of foggy in her little test tube skill thingy, but um, it's okay. It's okay. And her magic is about to be drained, so I'm going to have her stop doing the aura of soothing jake has a lycanthropy skill now which is werewolf uh stuff <laughs> like when he goes hunting it it gets higher oh no, no 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 i want you to drink from lana that would be the best option you get good moodlet and you get full uh we're going to have gabby work on her cool little what is this i don't know what the heck she's learning right now <laughs> we're going to have her work on her magic skill and then I'm going to have her conjure an apple. I'm not sure why it takes so long when I click on them. I could just click on the wand I guess. Uh, and she's going to eat one of these. Actually yeah, we're not going to do the magic uh, the conjure apple one. <laughs> you can actually catch this and catch that. And then what else is there to catch? Not much, not much. So his 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 collecting skill would be going up right now, I believe. Let's see if it works with bugs. Does it? I have no idea. Did it go up? Yeah? Yes, it did. Oh, wow. Holy moly. So he caught a monarch butterfly valued on the blah, blah, a thing. Oh, he got money for his books that I had him write while you weren't looking. Like, when I, when I moved them into a new town. I spelled slowly wrong, and now, <laughs> darn it, the slowly jogging dead, I meant to put jogging too, alive until sunrise and all my kiddos, and all my kiddos is a drama novel, uh, uh, Lana has unlocked some gags that will make sims gag, she can now fairy trap a trash can and perform tummy twister on unsuspecting sims, that's really cool, so let's, can we fairy trap this trap, oh no, we're not even selected on her. Set fairy trap. What do you do exactly? Can we set a... No. I guess it's only on the big trash can. So she's actually at level 4 of magic right now. Oh, that's great. That's great. And Gabby is... It's pretty sad where she's at. I think she's still at level 1. She hasn't even done... Oh, this is so embarrassing. Gabby, come on. <laughs> Are you still hungry? Oh, no. You're just smelly. Uh, well, he's kind of doing something, so let's just have you eat one more apple. Can you eat some garlic? Maybe. Oh, no, I missed it. Eat. Yeah, you can eat garlic. Does she get stanky breath? Let's see. Does she? Ha! Garlic breath. Whoa. <laughs> it might be time to scrub away that garlic with a toothbrush. No, thanks. You can... No, 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 no. You can take a brooding shower. All right, Lana. So what happens if you take the trash out. I don't know. Is this full of trash? Nothing's full of trash. 
We're going to have to make something full of trash. Oh, I guess he can actually clean the bird cage. Is the bird dead? Where is it? Oh my gosh, what happened to the bird? Did it die? Do you have it? Oh, I thought the bird died. I freaked out. <laughs> I would be so sad. We haven't even became friends with it yet. He's going to... No, not you. I'm getting confused with them. I keep not changing them back to the ones I want to play with. He's going to play with Damon for a few minutes. Hopefully he becomes better friends with him. And Lana, where are you? Lana, I have no idea. You're in your fairy house. Let's have you go somewhere. Let's go out somewhere. Woohoo in the fairy house. <gasps> what? I don't think she could woohoo in the fairy house with Jake, can she? No, because I'm pretty sure the only time you can woohoo in a fairy house is if you woohoo with another fairy. I don't want to do that. That would be really mean and unfair to Jake. Poor thing. Poor guy. Oh, you guys also said, let me mention this, that if he gets his werewolf skill high enough, lycanthropy, I hope that's how you say that, um, he can actually start turning sims into werewolves. I think it, it's an option. Uh, I also heard that you have to be in your werewolf form and it has to be on a full moon and it's under the mean uh, interaction with the sim. So we'll see. We'll see. <coughs> Sorry, my throat it, it hurts. I don't know why. I think it's because I've been cleaning a lot and I get dust in it. So we're going to catch all of these. I haven't seen any zombies yet. And I feel like the, the full moon just kind of messed up. It's in two days now. I don't know if that's correct. Oh, let's have Gabby recycle this. Okay, cool. Let's. It, once she recycles it, she'll put it in the trash can and we'll see what happens. Hopefully it's something awesome. I don't even know. What would happen? Maybe it would shoot out at her or something gross. That would be so funny and mean, but mostly funny. Of course. So. So. Ew. It did. I'm so smart. Oh, no. Lana, I hate you. <laughs> Oh, pick up the bugs that are on top of the trash. No, we can't put it away. Okay, fine. Clean this up, clean this up, clean this up. Clean this up, Gabby. I'm sorry. I should make Lana clean it up, to be honest. And perform tummy twister on unsuspecting sims. Let's um, perform it on Cal. Where is Cal? Monarch, butterfly, blah, blah. All right, Lana, come over here. Perform. Bestow flight felicity. No, play fairy trick. Tummy twister. Let's do tummy twister. I just realized that I haven't done the other ones. Maybe I'll do the other ones on him too. Fairy trick, chattering teeth, fairy trick, hot head, and then we'll do the tummy twister one. That could be the best. That could be the best way. It'll be in order. Okay, stop playing with Damon. All right, let's go. Does he stay on his? Oh, he stays on his thing. Oh no, he doesn't. Dang it! He's gonna put him away, isn't he? Poo. <laughs> She's so grossed out. That's hilarious. So this is chattering teeth? Yes. <laughs> I hope this isn't a bad thing. I hope it, he likes it. Jake, get the heck out of the way, fool. Oh no, he doesn't like it. Well, they'll, they'll become friends again. I'll have Gabby create the jar of friendship. It'll be, it'll be good. It'll be pretty good. Wait, Lana doesn't want to do it anymore? What the heck? Play fairy trick, hothead. Oh, okay, fine. Do it to Jake then. Play fairy trick, hothead. Even though he's already hotheaded, I believe. I wonder what it'll do. I wonder if it'll make a big difference. Maybe he'll just get hot. Oh! Oh my gosh, that is so cute! And mean! Alright, Lana, you big, you big meanie. Oh, oh, that's crazy. And she'll do tummy twister to Gabby. Oh, he likes it. He likes it. See, they're perfect for each other. He freaking adores her. That's great. Okay. So, um, let's see. I want to get them married, by the way. Maybe we should throw them a wedding party later on when they become friends with their coworkers. That's when I can do it because they both have jobs where you actually go and work with people. So I think that'll be good. And let's see what happens here. So this is Tummy Twister. Maybe she'll throw up. Ew. Scared. Scaredy cats are. Scared of pretty much everything. But they really show it when their life flashes before their eyes. Oh my gosh. No. She lost a friend. Desolate. When Sims, see, when sims get really, really lonely. Oh no. What is this? 
Okay, Gabby, you know what? You can go... Oh, shoot. She's in such a bad mood. Okay, use this. Go get the jar of friendship. Oh, man, I'm so sad. Dang it. I feel so bad for her now. Crap. <laughs> this is kind of funny, though. Let's be honest. All right, so let's just have her, um, I don't know, kiss Jake. Oh, he can make a promise to protect her. And then I'm going to have him turn into a werewolf. And then he will uh, hunt and get his werewolf skill up so we can start turning some people. I don't know what skill it has to be, so let's watch. Rawr! Is she going to pee her pants? You guys told me that she peed her pants last time. This one. I think, yes, we do have red valerian. Nice. So, I don't know. Like, somebody actually said they saw her pee her pants. And I, I missed it. I can't believe I missed it. Oh, she doesn't mind anymore. That's good. What a good little girl, cutie, girly. He's going to hunt solo. Uh, it's beginning to understand the world's curse. Okay, blah, blah. It's always the same freaking thing. <laughs> and then you're going to use this and then shower. So, no, 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 no. What are you doing? Are you flirting? You better not flirt with her. Kick your little butt. Oh, we also need to get him a vampire bed. I always forget. So, Gabby, are you almost done with your elixir? Once you're done with your elixir, we can throw it at Lana and become her friend. I feel so bad. I feel guilty now. All right. So, where's Lana? Get your little butt over here, Lana. You, you punk. You big meanie. Even though I told you to do it. So, I guess I'm the big meanie. So, let's throw it at her finally. Where is it? throw elixir at Lana Sanders. And what does it say? She made the jar of friendship. It was a cold trail for Jake Heron and he didn't find anything. Better luck next time. Whatever. So Jake, since you're in, 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 in still werewolf form. That was so weird. Okay, good. She's better friends with Lana. I'm gonna have her talk to Lana because this is, this is terrible. Ask about day. Um, chat. Enthuse about magic. Would she get extra friendly with her if she enthuses about magic because doesn't Lana have magic too? Friendly hug. Ask for fairy enchantment? Oh, what is that? What's a fairy enchantment? Oh look, they're they're almost best friends. Besties. They might be besties after this. Oh, need to brood. Oh, Gabby has to brood. Alright. Well, Gabby, you, you, you're such a downer. Um, you hear Jake. He's so funny. Okay, that's good. So hurry up with this. Cal isn't doing anything. Oh, yeah. Gabby has to meet a witch friend. So we gotta go out and find a witch friend after this. After her and Lana talk to each other. And she's asking her for a fairy enchantment. So she now feels... What? Flight of Felicity. Wee! That tickly sensation in the stomach is almost enough to lift Gabby right off the ground. So since Gabby is in such a good mood now, even though she needs to brood, which totally rhymed, we're going to go over... I I mean, you would think that maybe a witch would be at the elixir place? Hmm. How can you tell if there's a witch or not? It's really hard, actually. They don't really glow or anything like that. Are you a witch? I have no idea. Oh shoot, where can I go? Maybe I could go here. No. Are you a witch? Oh no, that's Jake. <laughs> Jake, you evil thing, you. Oh, I thought there was a person right there. Okay, there's a crumple bottom house. These crumple bottoms, they're all, I think, one of each care uh, type of supernatural, I believe, the crumple bottoms. I don't really know though. Visit the Crumple Bottom House. So let's just go over here. We should probably visit with Lana, too. Let's just go as well. Cal can stay at home. Jake is hunting his little brains out. Which is good, because he needs his werewolf skill to be up. So hopefully we can uh, turn some away. people. <laughs> that would be great. <laughs> Lana Sanders is going over to the place and to see... Oh, look! she Was she flying, too? I missed it. Darn it. It's okay, though. There are plenty of times we'll be able to use that spell. And the door is opened. Who is this guy? We'll be invited inside. I believe one of them is a witch. If I'm not mistaken, one of them is a witch. The Crumple Bottoms. Uh, I think Crumple Bottom was that old lady in The Sims 2 that knitted and she was like a, a biatch. Am I right? I'm probably wrong. <laughs> I don't remember. And what is with this woman? She's like Wait, running listen. around. These are probably her, her offspring. <laughs> Is that the word I'm thinking of? Bianca is rich. So is Bianca a 
witch. She's a witch. Oh, score, score. Okay, we're going to become friends with her. We're going to do friendly introduction. Lana has to go to the bathroom, so you might as well go to the bathroom. Oh, man, you're in a bad mood. I probably should have not made you come. Maybe Gabby can be nice to this woman. We should have used the jar of friendship. Oh, we should steal this broom from her. Can we? I think we have, like, the worst broom ever. I don't even know where it is. <clears throat> so, let's, let's, um, can we cast a charm on her? Good luck charm. And then maybe we can be funny with her, make a silly face, uh, tell a funny story, I guess. I don't know if you could tell a funny story. I don't know if you're funny, Gabby. Are you? And she'll contemplate the meaning of life, so the stupid mood that will go away. Oh, it's actually about to go away. Oh, good! She now has good luck. Will that improve their friendship level? No, unfortunately not. I'm probably going to have to make a jar of friendship. I think that thing is going to be the easiest way to become Just friends with people, and, and I think I'm going to be very happy Two about kiddies. it. She's childish. Okay, good. Neat. Uh, since it's, it's about to go away, I don't feel that we don't have to really do it. <laughs> Better luck next time. She's rich. Lana, what the heck are you doing? So, is there a fairy that lives in this house? I don't know. Let's check. Is there a fairy bed here? No, I don't see one. Hmm, I could be wrong. I'm probably wrong. Darn, I thought they were all supernaturals, different types of supernaturals. Well, it would be it'd be nice if she can go and drink some some pollen from Oh, what is this? A little hidey hole. Oh look at all the brooms. Maybe they're all witches. Who knows? Well I could have her tend to the garden. Oh no, I guess not. Well Gabby can come over here and uh, harvest. I said that really funny and I just kept going with it. Why not? Why not? Can you bloom? You can't even bloom stuff yet. Lana, Love come it. on, man. Oh, you want to go home? All right. I'm going to have her do an aura of soothing and then just go on home. And Gabby will stay here trying to become friends with this this witch. Ha ha ha. <laughs> Cal, are you doing anything? Cal, this guy hasn't turned into a vampire yet. I'm assuming it's going to take two more days. Jake. Are you working on your hunting skill? Did it improve at all? Yes, it improved. It improved. Um, if he collects, if he randomly collects this, does that improve his hunting skill too? Let's see. Let's do a little test right now. I'm just going to be hovered over this. No, dang it. Dang it. <laughs> okay, well, his hunting. I mean, his collecting improved probably. All right, well... I mean, he's so close to improving his hunting skill. I'm just going to have him keep hunting. Hunting. Nope, not jog. Um, hunting one more time. And then you can come home and collect this. Oh no, he's hungry. Well, let's just do this until he gets to level 4 and see what happens. Hopefully, uh, we'll be able to turn somebody. Maybe we can go find... Oh, the stupid shower is broken. All right. Well, let's see if we can... Act oh, man. Everything is broken. Okay. You know what? You can clean out the bad food and actually serve some waffles and stop doing that. You're actually hungry, so it would be good if you did that. And then you can go to sleep, you poor thing. I'm sorry I bothered you. He got some loot. He found Firefly, Albus, and Blue Topaz. Wow, he got two. He got two things at once. I didn't even know that was possible. So that's pretty cool. He found an amethyst and a moth. I wonder if he can catch like five things at once. That'd be amazing. So he's not, he has a lot of stuff now. Has he improved to level four? Okay, good. We're going to invite this guy over next time. You punk, you better want to be turned into a werewolf. He found an uncut diamond. It's valued 144. If he cuts these, oh, I should get a gem cut machine, huh? I don't know how much they are. They're really loud. I have one in my current game and they're so loud. It bothers everybody that's sleeping, so I don't even, I don't even know. Let's just, let's just check it out really quick. So, I assume it's under here, hobbies and skills. I mean, not hobbies and skills. Ho oh, yes, hobbies and skills. <laughs> Gem you cut machine. So, it's 1,900 something simoleons, 1,975, and I'm just going to place it out here. I bet it's going to wake Cal up, because that's how loud it was before. So, too bad you can't smell sneeze, can you? No. Alright, well, that's fine. 
So if you click on a gem that you have in your inventory, it, it says you can get it cut with the machine. And depending on how many gems you've cut before, gems, gems, you can either do like an emerald or then it goes to oval and pear and plum bob and heart and stuff like that. It's really, really neat. I, I really love that feature and they all look amazing. And I think the higher quality the cut, like the the more expensive it ends up being. I could be wrong. Also, when you use the gem cut machine, you get dust out of it too. So watch, you'll see. He'll successfully get, oh, come on. Wait, see, is did he wake up? No, he didn't wake up. Okay, good. Never mind. I thought it was going to give him bad moonlit from waking up. Jake should be getting some dust. Yes, see, that's, that's the plus about it. You also get dust. And dust counts towards potions, so you can actually use a gem or dust, which is great. I hope that makes sense. I'm not I'm not really sure. <laughs> and you need to repair the shower. Gosh. You haven't even eaten. Oh no, this is bad news. So Lana failed at cooking. Ugh, poor Jake. You know what? You can just have a quick brain freeze all mode. Lana can wake up. Oh no, she's super tired. She needs to drink pollen punch and then sleep. The carpool is probably going to come for her. Maybe she should take the day off. So, oh, this is bad. This is so bad. Why do you have to be such a horrible cook, Lana? I just ruined everything. <laughs> oh, I can't put them in the trash can. I'll put them in this trash can. There we go. Okay, Gabby, are you still talking to that woman? Or are you brooding? No, you're not. Or did you get kicked out? All right, well, let's just go home. <laughs> my bad Cal is thirsty and Cal is friends with Gabby so I'm going to have Gabby come home and he can drink from her which would be cool because uh, I don't know that sounds cool all right Cal don't even think about it there here we go drink from her oh um drink no I point I clicked on Gabby drink there we go and then Gabby can tend to her garden or not. Um, aww. She has the fertilized garden with best fertilizers, but I know if I do that, she might get rid of the bugs or something. And like the really good plants, like the flame fruit. So, oh shoot, I don't know. Fertilize with an apple. Fertilize with an apple. <laughs> and then you're not gonna fertilize anything. She's in a bad mood. A bird beneath the earth lies a dormant seed that yearns to grow. After searching deep within herself, Lana has discovered how to coax a plant to fruition by using bloom. Oh, that's exactly what I was waiting for. So if she can use it on this, oh no, she can't for some reason. What the heck is going on? Is it her magic? Is it because her magic is draining? I'll have her stop the Oreo soothing. Oh no, she's probably tired too. Oh, actually, I think it's already bloomed. Yeah, it is. I can see the, the mandrake right there. She could bloom this one though. Unless she's too tired, that'd be that'd be annoying. <laughs> she's so. Uh, did she get a day off work? Yes, it has been approved. Okay, so after this, there she bloomed it. The mushrooms are fully grown, and she can now actually harvest them if she wanted to. But we're going to have her sleep because she's really tired. And then Cal is just reading. You can keep doing that. Oh, actually, I want you to continue writing super good, which is based off of guess can you guess it super bad and then you once you're awake um i'll have you invite this guy over and see if we can turn into a werewolf so once everybody's awake i will uh come back and we will see if we can actually turn our first person into a werewolf and if not then i'm assuming it his hunting or his werewolf lycanthropy skill has to be higher and it does have to be at nighttime and or like at a full moon or something so we shall see we shall see it'd be weird if they made it that much of a pain to do it because for vampires it's super easy you just become their friend and they they'll like accept it no matter what so i'm gonna have him repair the stupid shower and then he can continue writing the book and i will be right back oh, wow he actually broke it okay so we can repair this too and then i'll be right back I just invited him over and he seriously just appeared out of nowhere. I'm not even kidding. I'll collect that later actually. So what is he doing? Oh, He's being chatted to. All right. So Bill Misfit. <laughs> That's a cool name. Let's see if we can. Somebody said 
Cursed Bite. Oh, you guys were right. Oh, shoot. Okay, let's do a Cursed Bite and let's turn him into a freaking werewolf. I can't even believe this is happening so quickly. This is amazing. So we'll have successfully turned our very first person into a werewolf. I don't know how long it takes, actually. It might be like three days. Who knows? Unless he automatically turns into one right now. But it was, it is under the mean trait. So thank you to the person that said that to me. Let me know. I'll give you thanks in the description. And he is kicking his freaking ASS. And he didn't bite him though. What? Rar Bill Misfit has received a werewolf curse by being bitten by Jake Heron. Success. <laughs> I'm so excited. That was totally what I've been waiting for. Ah. Oh. That's my very first werewolf turning thing. I was going to do in my current household and then I completely forgot about it. And so I'm I'm kind of glad that I got to do it in this one. And what do you- oh, I'm sorry. I forgot that I've unlocked the door to everybody but my household. So can we unlock it actually? No. What? So let's lock and then unlock. Maybe I'm imagining things. I don't know. That guy's just... Oh, it, well, I don't know what's wrong with him. So, Cal, have you talked to your bird? I told him to fill Damon's food bowl full. That was the first thing I told you to do, which he obviously didn't do. And then I had him play with Damon, and then I'm going to have him teach him some greetings. And Jake improved his collecting to three. So I assume that since it actually tells you, maybe it isn't from... I don't know. I don't know. Let me know. I don't even... I can't... I never pay attention, really. I'm... If you can't tell, I have a hard time paying attention to anything. <laughs> and let's see if we can apologize to him. That'd be nice. Friendly apologize. Here we go. Let's see. He just wants to be your friend forever. You can be werewolves forever. <laughs> Together. We can form a pack. It'll be great. You're not going to hate me after that. You'll you'll forgive me and it'll be, it'll be awesome. Thank you. Thank you, Bill Misfit. I'm sorry that we sentenced you to a lifetime of furriness, but um, it'll be okay. I mean, if it, if it really bothers you, maybe you can ask a witch to heal you? <gasps> we can heal somebody! Oh, snap! We can heal people now, too. Oh, that's really cool. I didn't even think about that. Well, actually, I don't even know she has that elixir, but I know that, that there is an elixir for it. Crash these stupid bugs. And what else? What are you- wait, what? What is going on? Why are you glowing? Is it because she has that- oh, she does. Flight of Felicity. And you're hungry, so I'll have you serve some peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, and you won't be hungry anymore, hopefully. And you're smelly too, so- oh god, that's so gross. You can clean that and then use that, and then you can clean that, and then use that. Unfortunately, I haven't- let's upgrade this, actually, can we? No, we can't. He's a handyman, isn't he? No, he's not. Darn it. Oh, yes. Kind of. I know Cal got a handiness skill from repairing the shower and the computer. That was pretty annoying. <laughs> Where's your bird? Oh, why do you keep putting your bird in your pocket? That's kind of sad, the poor thing. He's his friend. Look at how low that skill is. All right, so I'm going to go now. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode as much as I had fun making it. That was awesome. That was the first time I saw that, so I think that's pretty cool. And Jake... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Stop, 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 stop. What is that? A hedgehog? <gasps> is that a little hedgehog? Oh, pygmy hedgehog. Let's get it. Oh my gosh. Look at how cute that is. What a cute little ending to this, to this episode. All right, I'm going to go now. Hope you enjoyed this. I will talk to you tomorrow with a late night let's play, I believe. I forgot my schedule already. <laughs> and he's missing his job. Good gracious. And yes, have a great day. Any feedback is greatly appreciated, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye, guys.